Squishy was born with short spine syndrome. Only about 25 dogs in the world have this. And Squishy wants to go away. <laughs> Squishy is the boss. He rules everybody in the house, human, canine, feline. He's quirky, <laughs> dominant, and uh, very lovable. Hi, I'm Joe. And I'm Sally. And this is this Squishy. Is Squishy is a dog. He's definitely a coon hound. He's taught all the other dogs to howl like a hound dog. But he's just a normal dog and we don't really think of him as a special needs dog or a short spine dog. He's just squishy to us. Squishy was born with short spine syndrome. It's a really rare genetic condition. In his particular case, it starts from his parents being related. Before Squishy was rescued, he actually lived with the family that bred him. The mother reached out to a known short spine advocate that actually facilitated Squishy getting into Utah Animal Advocacy Foundation and then facilitated the foster home. Squishy was a natural part of the family coming in and um, he's just been a part of our family ever since. He can go a mile, maybe a quarter of a mile walking before he starts having a hard time breathing and that is because of his short stature. At this point, that's the only health issue besides his legs are too long and he can't itch his body. Okay. He runs around with rope toys. He loves to play tug of war. He'll run the yard like he's on patrol. Anything else, it really hasn't been a problem. We have Sammy, Frankie, Bane. Then we have Kucky and we have Kaya. Squishy is very dominant. So even though Bane is 110 pounds, Kaya is 80 pounds and Kucky is 60 pounds, Squishy is the boss of those three. He can tell them what to do. He rules the house. He rules everybody in the house, human, canine, feline. And we all have to feel Squishy's wrath if he doesn't get his way. Squishy. Frankie is the only one that Squishy will let come up to him and lick his ears or groom him. Frankie is grooming <laughs> Squishy as we speak. <laughs> When he eats or drinks, he prefers elevated stations. It's easier for him to eat. With platform dishes, it's a lot harder for him to bend over like a normal dog to eat. You already ate. You ate like 30 minutes ago. He absolutely loves food, but unfortunately Squishy's on a diet because of his frame. It's a mobility issue that we try to keep him at 34 pounds. And we're not successful, in case anybody's wondering. Squishy's 36. I've been trying to get him to lose two pounds for a good year now. And we're at a standstill of who's gonna win this weight battle. So far, Squishy. So we set up a Facebook account for Squishy and then about six months later, set up an Instagram account. And for some reason, he just took off. It seems like if he's doing something really naughty, um, people go crazy for that. He's such a, a unique and special dog, and I think sharing it with other short spine owners, we all follow each other. We do get some negative comments on social media. Some people think that we're teasing him or that we're making him beg for food. They just don't understand that that's how Squishy is. To me, Squishy is just a normal dog, despite his short spine syndrome. He was just special to us. There was something about him compared to all the other dogs that we've fostered. He was just meant for us, he was just meant to be. There's a strong community out there, and even if it's not an animal with special needs, I say always choose to adopt rather than shop. Dogs have a great survival instinct, and they just, they're happy. They can overcome almost anything. <laughs>